built. He was the superintendent of telegraphs and postmaster general of Australia. Who set, who set he the whole thing up? Yeah, he built the, oh, right. I see. Uh, the telegraph you, line, line from, so from Port Augusta to Darwin. Kind of, um, <laughs> I've got horse, another one here, and machine. Alice Springs is named after his, his wife. wife. That's what I was about to say. Ah. Must be the river's named after him, <laughs> and the, the Alice Springs is named after Keeps his wife. Keeps it in the family, yeah. then. Yeah. Nice one. Well, let's hope that all that knowledge uh, gets us the it's clue. Not, it's, it's quite small, Alice Springs. Only about 27,000 people live here. You're just going over it now. Let's see where... Yeah, we just... This is it here. OK, we're going to land... Can we land OK, I want to look up this quotation. That was great, amazing. You, you, who who said wrote? that first message? What, what hath uh, God wrought? Yes. Samuel Morse, I should think. 18, <laughs> 1830... Yeah. Or 1836. 1836, I'd guess. So we're just by the, uh, the old Roughly. dry riverbed there. In fact, it's um, quite greener than you would it's expect because it rained here about three weeks ago. And it's yeah. As soon as it rained... The crust and everything, and the scrub just grows instantly. There's lots of children here. Oh, OK. I can see. Little groups well, maybe, some, maybe one of those knows where the, where the, post <laughs> where the telegraph, telegraph office, office is. is. <laughs> With the tippy-tappy thing for putting yeah. the horse coding. Yeah. It's forevermore going yeah. to be known as that, yeah. isn't it? And everybody's wearing these fly hats, which is what I should be wearing. Only Vivian Westwood didn't make one. Right, thank you very much. Susie, are you beating, I'm beating the boys with a stick. <laughs> Hello. The That's the camel there? stick you picked up, is it? Um, I guess it's got to be in here somewhere. Yeah. The Post Telegraph Office. It's north of the Station <laughs> Master's residence and kitchen. You may, you may actually see a telegraph line somewhere. I don't know. But, yeah, there's um, telegraph poles and lines. Yeah. Right, yeah. All over the place. I think there's a pole. Well, I, from this map, it looks like there's a pole um, near the near the office. In fact, three poles the, near the um, office. Where's the Morse code place? If Susie gets lucky here, we can yeah. pull a bit of time yeah, back. Let's oh, this is the clue we've got to do <laughs> This is on. the one, isn't it? Thank yes. you. Very yeah. helpful. Not thank Find you. out where... Uh, through here, I think. What hath God wrought? In here. In here. You there, yeah. What are you up to? Oh, you there, maybe yeah? in here, maybe in here. Yes, yes, yes. Your clue has just arrived oh. from the... The clue's arrived. Treasure hunt. You've got hunt. us all excited. Your clue has just arrived from the... Dot, dash, dash, dot. Oh, oh no. Dot, dot, dash, dash, dot, dash, dot. Dash. Hold on, you've got the Morse code. Dash, dot, dash, Here we go, quick. Dot. Well, how many stops are... Is it dot? What was it again? Dot, dash, dash, okay, dot. OK, ready, ready. Dot, dash, dash, dot. 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 Dot, dash. That's that dash, one. Dot, dash, oh, dot. What was the second, second one? one? What's the second one? One at a time. Okay, second dot, one. We've got P. Go on. Uh, then, then it's just the dot. E. 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 Then uh, dot, dash. A. P. Dash, dot, dash. Dash, dot. Yes, yeah, peak. 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 Hang on, did I just say dash, dot, dash, yeah? Yes. Yeah. And then dot. E. Ooh, OK. P. Well, we got peak. Key, a name. Someone called peak. Peak. Peak, 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 peak. peak. Anyone there called peak? Or have... There's no, there's no one here. Peak. Peak. E? Peak. Um... Maybe, oh, hang on, hang on, these names in a Catherine Young. Is, is there somewhere peak. where they put the messages? Have a, yes. Have a yes, peak. I've, I've got it. The peak, the peak, I've got it, it's not the clock. The well done, Susie. Know. Where was it? Uh, in the peak, a uh, pigeonhole, just behind the, the Holy Bible. Yeah. Uh, the name. Mm. Well done. Well, listen, that's fantastic. Excellent. Well, well, well done. Thank you very much. That was great. Let me tell you then, just let me bring you up to date because <laughs> I didn't have time. <laughs> yes. I didn't have time during the excitement of getting that second clue. You won another £200 for the second oh, clue. You oh, won oh. Yes. £300 for this. You've got £600. And oh. the news gets even better yeah. because you've pulled back your deficit. Thank, Thank you, You're now more or less on time. Just, uh, just uh, actually uh, a few seconds well, under. That's not good. Really really fantastic. Away. So, <laughs> brilliant, brilliant work, Susie. Yeah, Thank you very much well indeed. Thank you, I'm so excited. I'm glad you pulled back some time. We're on track now. Hmm. That, was, that was ever so good. You, you discover that uh, Morse code. Yeah, he's good it's good. Decode. <laughs> do, you, do you know any Morse code anyway? I mean, could you have struggled with that? I could have done that with other things, but it yeah. would have took me a while. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, Susie, well done on clue number three. Mm. We just want you to cast your mind back a bit, though, don't we? Because we just wonder where exactly you found <laughs> clue number two. We were in such a rush, we, we obviously didn't ask you then. Yes, I went into the bar, yep. and um, on the right-hand side, there was sort of like stained glass set into the wall, oh, and it was a rainbow. rainbow, and opposite there, 
That's exactly where the clue was. Uh, right. So the opposite of the rainbow. Of the rainbow. And just to tie up all the loose ends on that clue, we worked out as well yes. after the event <laughs> uh, that uh, hang about referred to the Garn River. Yes. It was yeah. uh, putting the G in front of the yeah. H. Anyway, yeah. that's yeah. all done and dusted. And the good news is you've got yourself £600. You've got three clues solved. <laughs> and you've got a few seconds in hand oh, to boot. You made great. up that deficit. Yeah. So very well done. Thank you. Oh, right. I might good. just walk back then this time. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Not as such. Not yet. Um, so, Susie, we hope you've got your breath back, and we're not going to stop the clock again, remember, until the end of the full 40 minutes. Susie's oh, really? taking one right. more helicopter flight, okay. and the, the last clue is somewhere nearby. So, Susie, let's start the clock once more, and can you read out clue number four for us? Do you us? want to know where I am before you That'd start the clock? Yeah. All right, Susie, tell us. <laughs> this area here, where I am, is actually Alice Springs. This is an old spring, and now it's called Alice Springs because Alice was married to Charles Todd, who obviously the river mm. was named after, so that's where it all gets its name from. Ah, ah you're learning you every day. Indeed. <laughs> yes, Mark's nodding, you knew that already. <laughs> you knew that, didn't you? But, yeah. but he's flattering you. Four yes. Ago, anyway. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, do you want to start the clock? Yes, thank you very much for that. Yes, let's okay. start the clock and get on with clue number four. Here we go. At eight o'clock, Great Sandy almost offers Pudding Park. In a river area, then, from a birdie billabong, get a cosiday grub. Oh, there had to be a billabong there, didn't there, somewhere? <laughs> At eight o'clock, Great Sandy almost offers pudding. Park in a river area, then, That's from insane. a birdie billabong, get cosiday grub. So, eight o'clock, what do you think that refers to? <laughs> I don't know. We're we'll looking in the slang book, I think, for a start. <laughs> At eight o'clock, right, Great Sandy's the desert, it's I would the have thought. It's the sandy desert, isn't it? Almost offers pudding. Desert. 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 Right. Yeah, one one yeah, S less. Yeah, okay. One, yeah, yeah, okay. Great Sandy. So we've got desert, which, which that narrows it down, doesn't it? Not much desert well, there. Eight o'clock. If you're doing the angles, I suppose could be this way. But I mean, all right. We'll get Susie to ask her pilot yeah. to fly. I'm in the heli. Sandy, it's eight o'clock. Southwestish, would you say? So she's going to need some direction. Yeah. Um, probably southwest, I would think. Yeah. But towards southwest. towards actually towards Alice Springs, I think. Thanks, towards Alice what Spring think, Desert then? Park. Towards the town. Eight oh. o'clock refers to the direction you should fly. So yeah. um, well, your pilot's right, probably better at working that out than anyone else. So There's no river area over south there. South well, west, really, I'm, I'm isn't more it? convinced it's yeah. the Alice it's Springs the, itself. It's nodding, so it must be right. Well, okay, this clock still gives us okay, that. Okay, so towards right. the town. Okay, great Sandy is des desert. Then what do you think? Alice Springs Desert Park. So desert it's Park. Okay. okay. Well, hold on. We got park here. Yeah. There we go. Well, they're just working that out. That's the uh, telegraph station that we're just leaving. The first European settlement in the area. Susie, we found Alice one Springs up, Desert Park. He's one up yeah. there earlier. Alice Springs Desert Park. Yeah. Where have you found that? Sounds like so it's, it's on the map. Dish. Southwest dish. Did you just say it's on the map? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh. I know it's on the map. Where is it? Southwest. -ish. Southwest. Southwest of where you are now. Let's be on this map. Oh yeah, I can see it. I'm with you. I'm with you. Yeah. Do you want me to go there? Yes, yeah, please. please. Yeah. Yes, and then in a river area from a birdie billabong, get cottage. I haven't got to pick up a big fat grub and eat it, have I? Please say no. A birdie billabong. Why a birdie billabong? Anything more on? Um, birdies are well, as one under par. It's unlikely. Is there? It's a golf it's course. It's a golf but, course. Uh, Not there. I don't think there. Let's have a look. Kookab Kookab kangaroo and kookaburras. Yeah. I can see a kookaburra. No, I'd be happy. Okay, but, so obviously the park is going to be quite big. Yeah. Uh, where, yes. Where, where, where well, do you think this, exactly? Well, this birdie billabong. Uh, there's a yeah. there's a birds of prey display, but could be that. What's this? Well, let's work on down. What's cosidae? Yeah. Oh, that's cosidae is a is a family of again cosidae grub. Cosidae grub. I'll have a look over. Well, it might be worth the it. Might be worth going to the uh, encyclopedia. Two S's. CD. So two S's. Yeah. Yeah. Cos I D A E. Is it an anagram? It's a leopard. It's a moth. Or is it a grub? It's a moth. Is it? Oh, it's a moth. Cossidae grubs a moth of mo a moth of what though? Let's have a look. Wow, well, we got any? There's well, there's various. Park in a river area. Hold on, we're, we're looking for. I'm just trying to think here. Park in a river area. Is there a river? Are we any closer to working out where? Have you got a leaflet of the park there? Susie, so yeah, we, we have, have yeah. and we think there's something here um, uh, about rivers. Uh, there's a river, rivers habitat area. What was it again there? There's a desert, desert rivers, rivers habitat, habitat, which is probably our best bet at the moment. Yeah, cosidae does appear to be the various different sorts of moth. Moth. Oh right. Yeah, because so there's a, a leopard moth. Of but this is the grub something. of the moth. Yeah. Yeah, as opposed to lepidoptera, which is moths. Yes. Well, oh, so that says okay. on family lepidoptera. Yeah. yeah. 